Hey there, Cancerian. Welcome into Sage, Sunset Healing Tarot, and thank you so much for being here. I do hope you are well. Thank you for liking the video, sharing it with those you love, and for subscribing to the channel. Welcome in. If you're new, do hit the subscribe button if the messages resonate with you. And if you're returning, much love and gratitude to you. Thank you for being here. Welcome in your energy into this reading so that we can all get some accurate messages out for you. So this is the money and career reading Cancerian. So we're going to take a look. So we'll be taking a look here at what's coming up for you within the next three days for your money and career messages. You made a decision a long time ago. Bear in mind that these are general tarot card messages. So all of the messages may not apply to all of you. So take the ones that do apply and the rest let them fly. Cancer, right? So you made a decision a while back to walk away from a, a life, a lifestyle that was undermining your true value, your true worth. You decided to separate from that which was keeping you out of alignment with your self, your well-being, a lifestyle that was telling you this is all there is, keeping you in boxes, mental boxes, physical boxes. People that wanted to keep you back as well and wanted to keep you in um have you maintaining a low vibration but you knew there was something else i'm getting the energy of a woman out of the bible something about faith here one that would dec decide to walk away headstrong from a village or from a family that was not serving because she had an inclination or he in her that there was so much better out there and this one decided to listen to just move away from this lifestyle in this lifestyle, there was too much disorder and chaos and ruin that was taking place. You can see this being left out in the cold, depending on other people for how you feel your emotions, depending on other people for your well-being. That's what you walked away from. Now I feel cancer as you did that. You stepped immediately and I feel into some beautiful well-being here with the Queen of Pentacles energy. <clears throat> So I feel like you could be disconnecting from a certain idea or a partnership that is not serving you or even a relationship that's keeping you from really taking the necessary steps towards serving your purpose or, or, or really living out your vision. Something was hindering that. It was telling you, no, you can't. Now this could have been family and friends or just the environment that you were raised in, the things that you were used to hearing and seeing around you, just that frequency. And you could feel that it was holding you back and you didn't want to be suppressed or oppressed anymore. And you decided, listen, I can feel it in my blood that I have that royal blood running through me. I, just, I know I'm wealthy. I feel you've been investing your time and your energy into possessing things that makes you feel valuable. And I feel you could be inheriting something of a legacy or a gift which you have to use that makes you feel stable in your mind, in your heart, as if you know you have something to rely on, which could be, which is money. Because you're coming around as the queen of pentacles, full circle. You notice she's wearing red, green, blue, everything here. So I feel like you're being led, guided to, to becoming the queen of pentacles. You're going to be liberated. It's true. You're going to be free. You are going to be great. Your soul is being exposed to light as if you are singing your song here. You know, your full expression is coming to light. You see that the Queen of Pentacles is very, very abundant. It's because she's very smart, very intelligent, very graceful, very generous too. And you have a magnificent, vibrant energy about you. Remember to hit the like button if the messages are resonating with you so far. All right. In the past, you weren't feeling stable, whether that was financially or in your sense of security. Or, you know, just having things work out for you, feeling accomplished. That's what I'm saying with the Five of Pentacles energy. That's what you walked away from. You had this great vision of what... And it's important that you pay attention to the energy in which what that you're moving away from because it is what is causing you to have a greater vision, all right? So you're using your old stories to create the new and your new story is one of complete, supreme abundance and stability, whether that's financially, mentally, physically, spiritually. 
coming into your feelings of safety and success and accomplishing things that you've always wanted, just that well-being. You didn't want to feel needy. You wanted to feel wealthy and abundant. The Nine of Pentacles is bringing in that in for you as you keep moving forward on your journey. And I feel you may have to do this alone because you may need to focus all of your attention upon yourself so that you can build your faith, your stability. You can focus on working on what you need the most for your, especially for your internal well-being so that you're not deceived by anyone, especially your own self. You're not deceived by illusions um people portraying themselves as, as this or as that you're able to use your discernment well okay to know what's good for you and how to move to make decisions quickly that's the life i feel you're moving into and maybe being single allows you to hear yourself clearer so that you can become well inside out the Nine of Pentacles energy you see here is my Goku card, which is powering up inside out, Kameyame energy. So you need to ignite that fire inside of you so that you walk ignited. That's the energy of life. That's you being alive and knowing who you are. Powering up, tapping into all of your streams of power and so your well-being flows to you. All right, so you may need to be on this journey alone in some cases as you as um, when it comes to your money and career. What is this career path? So your career path has to do with water, body, healing, heavenly, cosmos, psychic abilities. The star energy cancer in is you focusing on restoring what was lost whether in yourself or in others, helping people to reclaim their identity, their self of pride, their well-being. So if you're one that's coming from a hard life with the five of pentacles and you've had to really pull yourself out of it, maybe you were the only one in your family that did this, take, took this brave, bold step or have this amazing vision for yourself and you feel like you're, you're doing it alone, but you're really not because once you make the decision, the entire universe is working with you because you know you have a mission. And this mission is in healing with the star energy. That is your purpose, I feel, for majority of you that are listening now. The star card is the card of Aquarius. It's like quick thinking, being quick on your feet, taking action, healing, um, filling up places that needs to be filled with emotion, well-being, nurturing, love, receiving to being able to receive and to give and creating balance and harmony around you and for those that are around you. Okay, I want you to have hope that there are things that are going to prosper in your future. And, you know, I feel brightness as you see here and the universe is working with you as you align with your destiny tell me more about so this is what you're heading into now tell me more further about what cancer is heading into career wise next three days what is the four of pentacles the four of oh my god something that you're investing in you're going to take action to do something and you're going to oh my god so see the wheel of fortune and the victory energy here is supreme because the, the six of wands is victory, success. And the wheel of fortune is destiny. Because we're talking about the destiny energy with the star card. Remember, this is what you're meant to do. Fortune, success, felicity, increase in your abundance and things flowing into you. You can see that. I feel you're open now to the universe. You're now an open channel from the universe or in the universe or for the universe as it sends messages through you. It sends healing through you. Its abundance flows through you naturally as you found your place here as reclaimed abundance. You know, reclaimed your abundance here in your place as the king, queen of pentacles here. So career rise, this energy could be an opportunity with the star card that wants to come around in your life something that's going to be returned to you in the future okay that was lost and maybe your sense of purpose it's so beautiful coming up for you and it's something that you've been investing in 
I feel like some of you, if you're investing in something like the lotto or a business, something that you've invested your time, your energy, and your money in, it's prospering. This feels like this one is wheeling out the wheel of fortune. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's really, and I feel so it could be something happening beautifully in Christmas time because I'm getting the paper that the gift wrapping paper, not gift wrap, but the one that we use to stuff as stuffing that soft tissue kind of paper. I'm getting that feeling that's unraveling off of the wheel of fortune energy as if a Christmas gift may be coming into you. We have the star, maybe coming into you soon too. So yeah, this is very powerful because it's it's good news or great, beautiful news that's coming into you from a great source. So let's see who is the Six of Wands. Who's bringing in this Wheel of Fortune to Cancer? Six of Wands energy. Fire sign. It has something to do with work. Maybe you're going to get a new job. We're going to get the news that you're getting the job that you've wanted, something that you've hoped for. Something that you, maybe it's a job, you know, we see the tree of pentacles, something that you can show your skills in, you're going to be of service. Maybe it's an interview that you went for, you're going to get the call for that to say, yeah, you've been successful with that. You've been giving, it could be a job I feel serving others, having to do with your emotions. Yeah, and the, the knight of pentacles came out, which is the card of service, being serviceable and having a responsibility so within the next three days or until december christmas time maybe the news is going to tell you that something is coming through by christmas time okay but with it this is all money reading and career for the next three days for your cancer and it's beautiful we see a lot of beautiful pentacles we see work appreciation for the work that you do we see service we see great rewards coming in and blessings victory healing and moving forward into your abundance as the Queen of Pentacles. Tell me a little bit more about the Queen of Pentacles. Yes, you're going to be happy. Something to celebrate with the Three of Cups energy. I feel like something is either ending or coming to a closure or a decision that's been made that's making you happy. Like you've received this. So I'm saying with the Victory card and the Success card here. You know, a decision has been made. That's making you happy, you know, something to celebrate here. And I feel it's something about healing. It's going to heal something for you and cause you to feel comfort. What is this three of cups healing? Wow, the justice and the hierophant. Okay. So it's healing. So this conclusion, this reward that you're getting, celebration, the success, marriage alliance, so it can be a business proposal, servitude, goodness, mercy, inspiration. Mm, okay. So maybe you're going to be getting a call from a person that wanted to work with you or yeah, in business. So maybe this person will call you, this hierophant is your person that wants to hire you. Maybe you met this person before, maybe not. So like I was saying earlier, it could be a, your interview that went well and you're going to be getting a call for that soon. Okay. And it's going to be good for you. The justice energy saying it is what is right. You deserve this you are worthy of it um yeah you executed well you deserve this 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 victory that's coming up for you all right and that's why you're sick it's sitting as the queen of pentacles you're going to get probably a big a greater position than you expected with a greater pay than you initially anticipated and you deserve it okay so you need to sit in that position of feeling worthy of this beautiful blessing that's coming into you for your money and career. Remember that this is our next three days reading, Cancerian. All right, so remember to thumbs up the video on our way out. We're doing a yes and no session. So go ahead and ask a question in your brain here. 
or a load and then I'll shuffle and get a response for you yes or no so do that no thumbs up the video please share it with those you love and hit the subscribe button now that the messages are resonating with you I suppose that that's why you're still here please support your support means a lot to me thank you so meditate on your question anything at all and now we're gonna shuffle now and get that answer for you it's unclear it's almost like it's uncertain because of who is in charge and maybe you not speaking up and saying exactly like you're not being the front runner of the situation so you're not really calling the shots i feel like you need to position yourself as the eye, the one with the vision who is calling the shots to ensure that it gets done as you want it done. And then it will be as you wish. But if not, and you're leaving it up to chance and leaving it up to other people, they're going to just do as they please. So if you take the necessary actions, yes, the answer is yes. The necessary actions for yourself, to put yourself out there, to do more, to remove from you what does not need to be there, people, situations, things, and be the front runner with the vision here, manifest what you want in whatever time. And the answer is yes. The sun card is here, success and abundance for you. And maintain your vision don't be sway don't put you know don't keep moving your goals because of circumstances you know go harder you know have integrity all right thank you so much cancer much love thank you so much for all of your show support like share and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one much love thank you so much remember that you're all and all is within you take care